taken by Aiello, who had an assist on the goal by Spillane last night. Puck comes in deep, Spillane score! And the Hawks score 19 seconds into the second period. Ryan Spillane scores for the second game in a row. And St. Anselm has its first lead of the season. Back out to the point, but a takeaway and a two-on-one opportunity for Worcester State. Moving in, shot score! Will Ahern gets his first goal of the year, and this game's tied at one. This is Leach in deep. Leach the defender in unfamiliar territory. Centering pass and a goal! Chris LeMay, 2-1 Hawks. He throws to the middle of the ice, and it's chipped ahead. Matt Hayes, slap shot, save made, rebound, score! And the Hawks lead 3-1. Now they enter again, this is Petulo. Petulo gets to the middle, now a shot hits Petulo. Skate gathered down and they score. It's a power play goal for Nick Panucci. And it's now a 3-2 game. On a good sliding play by Peter Stafe. Now in front, they score! Andrew and Derry, and that's going to be the dagger. With 92 seconds left, it's a power play goal, and the Hawks regain the two-goal lead. It's nice to get the first one of the season. I thought we played pretty hard. Got some good quality shots on net. Gave them a little bit of an opportunity to sneak back in, you know, but I think overall, pleased with the effort of, of the guys that played. I thought he made some big saves at critical times. Uh, you're always, you always wonder, you know, with a you know, first year player, especially a goaltender, how he's gonna you know, deal with the pressures of playing a collegiate game, his first collegiate game, but I thought he showed no signs of being nervous and was calm and cool. And that one save where it flipped up in the air, he stayed focused on it and, and grabbed it out of the air. I did, thought he did a nice job. I thought Chris LeMay played well today. Uh, he plays hard, he's a physical guy, and always has his motor going. I've been working with the guys that shoot the puck more, and he you know, came up to that and did that, and really put the puck to the net, and dug hard in front, and it was good for him. He got the game winner today, got to ring the bell for two, two points for the win, and I'm pleased and happy for him.